Butler allows you to control the direction that individual patterns are stitched. The start points, marked with green circles, indicate the end of the pattern from which Butler will begin stitching. End points are marked with red X's. The two patterns shown here have end points, or red X's, that overlap. In order to allow Butler to stitch as continuously as possible, I need to reverse the direction of the duck pattern so that the duck pattern start point overlaps with the dolphin pattern end point. To do this, I'll select Edit, Reverse Path. You can see that the dolphin pattern end point now overlaps with the duck pattern start point. In the next tutorial, we will discuss how to recover from a thread break.